Hey, is that your phasers to fun? Hey, Captain. <laughs> they are so great. No, they're really not. Babylon 5 is the world of space tourism. We're about 40 years in the future. We're on the maiden voyage of space version of a cruise liner. Hi there, shipmates. Anybody order a captain? I play Captain Ryan Clark, senior officer on board Avenue 5, which is this magnificent spaceship. This ship is owned by Herman Judd, who is this flamboyant billionaire. Judd definitely has this air about him that is pompous. I came up with a week's worth of great ideas in like 11 minutes. He's someone who has got through life thinking that he's a genius, even though he's come up with one good idea. And so his CEO, Iris, her job is to shield the world from him and him from the world. Rev, what are NASA saying? Is NASA saying? Is it is or are? Yes. What is they saying? The scale and the scope of this show would be unlike anything anyone has seen before. You can really imagine 5,000 people arriving on here thinking they're going to have the best time of their lives. You're supposed to be on vacation. This is supposed to be the ideal circumstance to relax. And then something happens where all that is yanked away. <laughs> code not good, code bad! Everything is fine. Pay attention to my words and not my tone. Ah! The passengers were having to deal with things they weren't expecting to have to deal with. What the hell's going on? Should we be scared? Maybe. You're supposed to say no, you prick. Before you know it, all the norms have gone out the window. And it's an examination of how terrifyingly quickly social order can break down. People go a little bit crazy. I don't think people have ever seen a comedy like this. It's the details that make this so funny. No man left behind. Dead or alive. <laughs> no alive or alive. BTV, déchaînez-vous. Ah oui, déchaînez-vous.